Ian is advised. Roses are red. Violets are blue. When the Sea Morning Zoo calls your man, he better choose you. War of the Roses. Catching cheaters one at a time. And it starts now. All right, we got Dana that we're helping this week. Hello, Dana. Hey. So who are we putting to the test for you today? Um, unfortunately, my boyfriend, Austin. Okay. Now, this isn't one of those he's been acting different lately type stories. You're straight up pretty sure he's cheating? Uh, I mean, I don't know, but he's got a new friend at work, and I really don't trust her. Okay. And what, what is his friend's name? Amber. Okay. So you, you think something's going on with him and Amber? Um, yeah. They are... Definitely flirting with each other over Instagram, which I can see, and neither of them thinks I know about it, but obviously it's public. Oh, 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 okay. Now, but at this point, you said you don't have any actual proof. No, yeah. Um, that's why I emailed you guys. Okay. Well, let's see if we can find out what happens when Austin has the opportunity to send somebody some flowers. So you're going to get to hear who he chooses to send the flowers to and what he puts on the card, okay? Okay. All right. Time for the two questions. We ask every War of the Roses participant. Question one, are you sure you want all of this on the air? Yes. All right. And question two, how certain are you that when he gets these free flowers to send to somebody, he's going to choose you to send them to? I mean, that's what he's supposed to do. But I honestly have no idea what he's going to do. Okay. Well, let's find out. Darling at random. Good morning. I'm calling to speak to Austin Cassies. This is Austin. Good morning, Austin. My name's Ashley, and I'm calling from a brand new floral delivery service called FloralDesigns.com. How are you today? Good. How are you? I'm good. Thanks for asking. So the reason I'm calling is to ask you how often you think you order flowers. Uh, order flowers like as a gift or something like that? Yes. I guess every couple months or so. Is this the oh. is this a trick thing? Trick? Uh, I'm sorry. Yeah, the what is it called? The battle of the roses or whatever it is. <laughs> the battle? Uh, you, you mean the you mean war, war of the, the roses? roses? Yeah, is that what this is? Yes, actually, Austin. Yes, that's exactly what this is. <laughs> so I take it you've heard us do this before. Yeah, definitely. Okay. Have. All so right. uh, who who did this? Who put you up to this? My girlfriend. Well, who do you think put us up to this? Well, if it was my girlfriend, that would be pretty funny because she's the one cheating, not me. I am not cheating. So like, she didn't tell you guys uh, that last month she slept with her ex, right? That she didn't. Oh, uh, <laughs> not really, no. Yeah, I figured. Uh, yeah, she slept with her ex then lied to me about it. And then I had to find out when he told me about it. No, I told you we did not to sleep together. Well, that's hilarious because he said you did. He said it was a huge mistake. Well, he's lying, and you should trust me because I'm your girlfriend, and oh. we never slept together. Okay, all fast. right. So the, so the reason we were calling was because of this coworker of yours, Amber. Is something going on between you and her then, or no? Amber, no. I mean, we're friends, but I haven't slept with her or anything. I'm not the cheater in this relationship. I never cheated. I am not a cheater. We made out, and I told you about it after. You told me about it after I found out from him. You know what? If we're being completely honest about everything, I guess I should tell you uh, that I've been meaning to break up with you ever since it happened, but I've been waiting to do it. <laughs> what? Uh, waiting for what? Her dad had tickets to the Redskins-Cowboys game yesterday, and I'm a big Cowboys fan, so all I had to do was stay with her until we went to the game, <laughs> and now that's over. So I guess we can break up. <sighs> okay. Okay. So you found out she cheated and you only stayed with her so you could go to the game? Pretty much. Yeah. And I like her dad. He's a cool guy. So, <laughs> Is emotionless. <laughs> so now that you went, you're over the relationship. Yeah. No, this has been, uh, I've been kind of planning this. Okay. Sorry, baby. Uh, that, what? That, that is, that is. <laughs> Cold blooded. I don't know what is more dramatic, winning by that shanked field goal yesterday or this War of the Roses. I honestly, I can't even, like, uh, whatever. I never cheated, and if you don't believe me, then 
I don't want you as my boyfriend anyways, and good luck being in any relationship. This morning zoos, War of the Roses.